So today's video is gonna be kind of a continuation off of yesterday's idea. Um, I'm not entirely sure where this is gonna go. I don't even know what I'm gonna title this video. Um, if you understand what I just said, shouts out to you, because I barely do. So today I went through some of my online personas and presences and started trying to reconfigure things and consolidate and move things around. And the more I do that, the more I'm starting to realize that I've created entirely too many and I may just need to start over. However, that's not what I'm gonna do. And I'm using this as a tool to talk through some pretty big businessy ideas. And so bear with me. So I have, shout out to Five Stones. <clears throat> I used to work there. Around that time, I kind of coined the name Larry G. Um, that is my real name. My first name really is Larry. My last name does start with a G. The name Larry G kind of stuck. And that's also around the same time I started trying to build a website. At the time, it was LarryGeorge2.com because I'm the second, not a junior. That's a story for another day. But it was LarryGeorge2.com. I thought that was too long. I was just like, no one wants to say my whole name. So I shortened it to Larry G. And LarryG.com was taken. And so it was the Instagram era, like when it first came out. And I was just like trying to pick a name. I was too late to claim Larry G. So I'm just like scrolling, trying to pick a name. And then I see all these people saying, it's the real, it's the real, the real, blah, blah, blah. And I was like that, the real doesn't make sense for me, but it's. Um, I start a lot of my videos with, hey guys, it's Larry G or it's Larry G. And it was just like a thing. Points go to people who recognize me from the very first iteration of this name. It's Larry G, yo. I dropped the yo and just it became It's Larry G. And so I branded myself as that. Three, four ish years ago, I started playing with different names and trying to come up with something else because whenever you tell people, um, people say, oh, what's your website? You say, It's Larry G. And it's like, okay, LarryG.com. And it's like, no, you have to explain that it's It's I T S Larry G. It was a whole thing. So. I started playing with the idea of um, switching it to something else. You know, Larry G is just, somebody is holding on to that name and they are not using it properly because when I search it, it's garbage. So if you were the owner of Larry G, please give me my name back, I need it. Trying to come up with something else and just nothing is sounding good. Everything sounds like garbage or it's made up or it's not my real name. And I want to use my real name because I want it to be like a personal brand type thing. So I'm just going back and forth, going back and forth. And then I don't even remember how long ago it was. It's at least been a year now. Um, I saw people start using .co and I was like, all right, if I can't have LarryG.com, I might be able to get LarryG.co. So I take that. I have that domain. So I have LarryG.co and it's personal stuff and it's just like, a blog and all kinds of other stuff. Well, in between me finding .co and trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with It's Larry G, I started a business called It's Larry G Creations. So I was still in the vein of It's Larry G trying to figure that out and then I added creations to it. So naturally I bought that domain as well because I can't have a business out there without the domain. Um, Somewhere in between all that, I started another blog called The Pro Millennial. I also own ThePromillennial.com. Don't go there, there's nothing there. Um, the Pro Millennial blog, all that content has moved to LarryG.co. Fast forward to now, I'm trying to decide whether or not I can keep, or whether or not I should keep, It's Larry G and LarryG.co separate, or should I merge them into one? because currently out there floating in the internet sphere, there's LarryG.co, It's Larry G, and It's Larry G Creations. All separate websites, all separate domains, all completely different content. 
I'm trying to decide whether or not it's worth it to combine everything, have my legal business name just be It's Larry G Creations. I'm trying to decide whether or not I wanna hold on to It's Larry G or not. Stop naming stuff Creations, just let that be the global entity name, kinda of like Alphabet for Google. Maybe I don't need anything that's personal. Maybe I can just combine it all into one and have my photography portfolio here and then video stuff here and then design stuff here. And it's all one encompassing because it's who I am. And because what I do is a lot of visual storytelling, I think that may be the umbrella package that holds everything together. So in visual storytelling, there's photography and videography and design, and they all come together to make this thing. And I think doing it that way may work. What's up? Hey. I'm filming a video. Oh. This is gonna be a black and white part. You want me to leave? No, you can stay. I'm just going through a thought process out loud on camera. I love you. My wife, everyone. I'm fine with trying to merge them all into one. However, I am stuck trying to decide on a name. If you guys have input, I would love that input. So I've decided that I'm dropping creations from the running. So your choices are LarryG.co or it's Larry G. So I mean, which which one do you guys feel is better? I would really appreciate it if you would vote, leave a comment, um, tell me which one you like better so that I can, you know, kind of just pick one, move forward. I don't want I don't want to just pick one on my own because I feel like I've built them up, not separately. Everyone knows it's me, but like they have different looks to them, like LarryG.co is kind of a blue and gold and then like it's Larry G is kind of like my red and a tannish color and I really want to stick to the red and tan because I really love those colors together. I spent time developing the blue and gold. I just spent time developing that when I started getting into branding and stuff. That's a topic for another day. Um, I think that's all I have for today. I just really want to try to, I've decided on, I need to focus and bring everything together and that photography will be the main pillar and that design and video will be supporting pillars. But now I need to know which vein to go in. So am I sticking with It's Larry G because it's been there for so long or am I moving forward with LarryG.co because it's my name and it's not complicated to tell people and stuff like that. So I would really appreciate your vote. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Hit the bell for notifications. Subscribe if you like this stuff. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. And you can believe that.